Guys, this is Randy coming at you from a dealership in Charlotte. I'm a, with Factory Direct Marine and RV. We got seven locations. Uh, you can look us up on the internet, factorydirectmarine.com. And all of our videos is on our Facebook page. Please like us. Factory Direct Marine and RV of the Carolinas. Look us up, like us. We appreciate it. Uh, today we're going to do a walk around on a 2017. It's a 340 FL by Keystone. Laredo. Uh, nice floor plan, guys. Everyone I've ever sold, people love the floor plan. It's a front living room. It's actually a 37 foot coach. It's got four slides, tons of features. Go ahead and jump in those for you. This unit, if you notice, has a front cap. Gets rid of all your leak sites. Um, gives you metal aerodynamics, better insulation, whole nine yards. Gives you the high end look. It is a high end coach. This is a vacuum bond construction. Not only is it vacuum bonded, it's a welded aluminum cage. Now, a lot of people say they got a welded aluminum, then they got the wood rafters. Not on this coach. This is four sided welded aluminum. Even the rafters are welded aluminum. Gives you that durability, insulation factor, and easy clean. If you'll notice on my slide rooms, all four of them, are pulled for four corners. That keeps it coming in true every time, out true every time. Uh, keeps it from getting in a bind, makes your slides last a lot longer and less complications. You do have the quick release feature on the legs. Just pop it out, let it pop. You ain't got to put a little thing in there and get your hands all dirty. Pull it out, release, push the button, raise it up. A lot easier, makes it quick and easy to hook up and take away. If you'll notice, all of my baggage doors are going to be slam shuts, just like your motor homes. Just like this. And if you look, tons of tons of storage up under here. And the door slam shut, just like a motor home. If you look at this unit, it has a 19-foot awning, electric awning. Push button, comes right out, comes right back in. Nice little feature here, too, for the customer. These are aluminum steps. Triple, triple steps, and it takes one finger to put them up. How many coaches can you do that with, huh? Nice grab handle to help you get in and up and down coach. If you notice, all the windows are frameless. There is no, there is no trim around it to get all grody and molded up. Frameless windows, easy open, easy shut. The tent is actually in the window, not on it. Five years from now, it's going to look the same as the day you got it. It is vacuum body construction, which we've already went over. I'm pretty sure I just want to make sure. If you notice here, you've got an outside entertainment speakers. When you're sitting up under the awning and enjoying the weather, you can actually listen to the radio from inside. If you notice how they got the wheels spaced out, and it is a 16-inch wheel, this thing pulls beautifully. This does have the Arctic package on it. That means your underbelly is heated. It's also, anytime you're keeping you warm up top, there's a two inch duct forcing air down into the belly of the coach. Keep your tanks from freezing up. If you'll notice here, this has got a four point jack system on it, just like your motorhomes. Push a button, stand back, let them do the work. When you get done, you can walk around, not feel people walking, and it levels it up by itself. You ain't got to mess with it. This unit does have a bumper, place to put your sewer hose, place to put a spare tire, a nice sturdy ladder to get up and down. Because it is a dome roof, there's no place for water to stand. Also, this is pre-wired for backup camera if you should choose to have one. All your lights are LED, this is an LED backup light. The shore cord is in the very back of the coach, easy to get to in your campsites. It's not way up front like some of them, it's back here where your pole's going to be. <laughs> so you don't have to stretch out 30 foot of cord to get power. There again, guys, shows you a picture of the jacks coming down. Here's where you do your dumps, your black and your gray. Is your black hookup. Sorry, that's where your hookups are. Refrigerator vents. 
Now this unit comes with two gray tanks. One in the bathroom, one in the kitchen. However, this is your everything compartment. It's where you bypass if you want to winterize it, put city water connection up, fresh water tank fill connection, black tank flush, put your hose pipe on it, fill up the black tank. It's got jets on the walls that cleans it off, dump it, fill it up again, dump it, cleans your black tank out without having to go inside and put a, an old nasty uh, sprayer in it. Satellite hookups, the whole nine yards. That's the other part of your fast through storage. Two 30 gallon LP tanks. A lot of people's going with green energy nowadays. This has the place to hook up your uh, solar panel right here. Your landing gear controls are lockable so kids can't come by and play with it while you got it set up. All your dock lights are operated from right here. A nice area to pour, store more stuff. You know, your wood, chuck, your tire chucks, whatnots, your battery and everything's in there. You got the nice extended pin. The way this cap is designed, it's cut off here at the corners. So if you got one of the shorter bed trucks, it makes you get a little bit tighter turn radius. Come on inside, we'll show you some stuff inside. If you'll notice as I come in the door here, guys, first thing you notice is everything you can access from right here. Find out your levels, put your awning out, all your slide rooms, everything's easy accessible right here. I'm gonna jump up here. This is the front living room. Check this out. First thing I'm gonna show you right here, you got a nice sofa. That does make out into a bed. All your mini blinds are fabric. Come around here to the fireplace. That will take the chill out of the air. Now, if it gets below 40 degrees, you have to kick your primary furnace on. But it's a, it looks like a real fireplace, and it runs off of electricity. When your campground, save your LP. Use this for heat if you need it. Nice big screen LED TV. Tons of storage. Come back around here, you got another sleeper sofa. And this is the nice soft touch leather, real comfortable seating. Then move over here for the king and queen. You got you some nice entertainment seating with cub holders, right at the TV. You ain't got to break your neck to watch it in the fireplace. Notice here, all your ducts is a ducted system. They use a racetrack system. It's a continuous system. There's no, there's no 90 degrees or nothing in it. It goes, this air conditioning and the one in the back are hooked together. It flows at a constant, easy flow. Air conditions don't have to work half as hard as they do on the other ones with the brakes and stuff in it. This has got a quick, cool feature on it. If it's real hot, 100 degrees outside, you're down in Florida or somewhere, uh, she's cooking. Open these up, it disengages your ductwork, blows everything out of that big 13, 15K AC right here in the living area keeps you nice and comfy. When you get done, just close these back off and it re-engages your duct work and redistributes the air nice and evenly. You can also keep an eye on whoever's cooking down there. It gives you a nice view of the... It compartmentalizes all, just like your home. compartmentalizes everything. Drawers galore. The microwave sit lower so you can get all your stuff out and have to reach way up. Pull it right out. Come in, you got a three burner range oven. High output on the front and a nice oven. All the appliances, this comes with the stainless steel package. All your stainless steel fronts on your appliances. Uh, nice counter space here. Good little area to work with. This thing that comes out for your spaghetti pots or whatnot. Uh, nice deep. Look how deep that is. Real deep sinks, two-sided sink, a rinse and a wash area. Outlets everywhere you'll need one. One here, one here, one there. We got a four-door refrigerator. Works off of gas or electric. It's 18 cubic foot. It's gonna give you a nice big freezer area. Less trips to the grocery store. Works off of gas and electric, and if your electricity goes out for whatever reason, 
it'll switch it, switch it straight over to gas without you even touching it. Once the electricity comes back on, it'll switch it straight back to gas. No carpet in the area down here where you're coming in out of the campground. Up top, it was it was carpeted down here. No carpet, easy to clean. Nice freestanding dinette um, with two extra chairs that's folded away right now. What impresses me, people love about this unit, like I'm showing you all the drawers and everything, cabinets. Look at this pantry. This thing's huge. I don't want to say pantry's that big. Little three pull-out drawers, three big shelves here. And then you got all this stuff here to keep whatnots. Uh, just tons of stores galore, galore. A real door to the bathroom. It is a side aisle bathroom. If you look in here, look at that shower. That's <laughs> humongous. Sit down area if you want to sit down and take a shower. Tons of uh, storage, mirror, sink. A real ceramic toilet. Real ceramic toilet. Sits high too, you so don't have to crouch down to the ground to use the bathroom. Okay. Go on this back here. Bathroom's in the bottom on this fifth wheel. Back here gives you a nice walk around queen bed. That's a real queen bed. That's not your little short princess queen. That's a true size fifth uh, queen bed. Lets you walk around all three sides. And gives you this little counter space here and a, a little flat screen TV LED. And all of this hanging space here. There's your other chairs right there. There's your other chair there. More, more space here to put stuff. Tons of storage in this coach. Not to mention under the bed. Okay, guys, pretty much that's it. 2017 Keystone Laredo, brand new 340FL Factor Direct Marine and RV. Factory Drake Marine .com or check us out on Facebook.